Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to another vlog. Today is January 10th. It is currently 12.30. Um, I haven't vlogged in a long time, so I'm a little bit rusty. It feels a little weird to be vlogging. But I took a week off from YouTube recently. Um, I've still been filming and editing, but I just kind of wanted to take a week off to kind of rebrand, work on a new intro, work on new like little specs for my video to make them more interesting and my editing style and my color grading and just making my channel have more of an aesthetic more of my vibe um because right now i'm just i've just been trying out a bunch of different things to see what i like um and i finally kind of narrowed it down to like what i like what i want my channel to present when someone comes to it so that's what i've been working on um by the time you guys see this vlog you probably will already have seen the rest of my new videos that i've been working on since i've been taking this week off um and today um last night i was working on the intro new intro whatever and i got the notification to do the update for my macbook and i did the update and as soon as i did the update literally the um the, my screen doesn't work anymore so if i keep my screen like halfway open i can still see it and like edit that way so that's what i've been doing the last two three hours um if i move it if i like try to open it all the way it goes completely black i've been on with i've been on the phone with apple care for the last like two hours and we've rebooted it a bunch of times we've tried to like do recovery mode safe mode all of that and nothing has worked so i'm a little frustrated and it's just kind of overwhelming a little bit because it's like as soon as you get into the momentum of being consistent and trying to like really knock stuff out and get it done and I wanted to have like two weeks worth of content already planned out. Well not even planned out, just filmed and edited. So all I gotta do is go in, boom, boom, upload. You guys are constantly getting content from me. But my laptop is giving me the blues and it's just really, really frustrating right now. Like hella frustrating. Hey guys, what's up? So it's a little bit later on. I just finished filming and uploading on youtube i did all of the stuff i needed to do today so now that my makeup is done and i filmed my video for it today i'm about to head out i'm about to go get those beignets from beignet box it's like a 45 minute drive now it's so loud outside it's like a 45 minute drive now because there's traffic and the time that i'm leaving but it doesn't matter because i'm still going to go get those beignets and nothing's going to stop me i also want to pick up some food because i haven't eaten anything today I haven't had coffee haven't had anything i really I have water today so let's head out and i love the way that my makeup turned out this makeup look is going up on my channel i want to say makeup look just my foundation routine i love my foundation routine that i'm currently doing so be on the lookout for that and let's go get some beignets rattle all right guys after two hours of shenanigans i have finally made it to my destination oh let me see these glasses i hate wearing glasses and a mask i feel like that is like Pretty much. Well, we finally made it to the little truck. We're getting suited and booted so we can go get some bang. Yay! I'm so excited. Now I have a reason to drive all the way to Sherman Oaks for dessert. Have no change. Um, no, I'm gonna see if it takes card. Cause it's green. I wanna see how much time is on there. You see? Uh huh. Okay guys, so hopefully you can hear me because I'm vlogging from my phone because I left my camera at home. I was, wasn't thinking, I, I forgot it. But I'm in Nordstrom's because today I might be making a purchase of something that I've been wanting for a long time. <sighs> hopefully they have it. I need to see if they have it first. Okay, update. So I went to the mall to go to Nordstrom's and they didn't have what I was looking for. So we're gonna try again tomorrow. Um, right now we are at... Where are you? Oh, Marshalls, and then we might go into Home Goods, but um, we went to the mall and did a little bit of shopping, but I'm not gonna show you guys what I got because I'm gonna do a separate video on that. 
my hair looks so gross and i also need to take my hair down hmm should i take my hair down i'll probably take my hair down after we come back tomorrow so i don't have to worry about doing my hair today is january 20th it is wednesday and it's 10 5 a.m so i don't remember the last thing that i vlogged to be honest with you guys um uh, i have no idea but today we are going to run a couple errands. I think I want to do a juice cleanse. So I'm going to stop by Press Juicery and pick up the juices. I want to go shop for some workout clothes, like some workout gear and stuff like that. And then, um, matter of fact, I think the last thing that I vlogged was when I was at the mall trying to find um, this purse and this wallet that I wanted to get. So I don't know if I mentioned it in the day that I went to the mall or not, but I went to four different stores. So I went to two Nordstrom's, a Saks, and a Neiman Marcus to find the YSL Lau camera bag. They were completely sold out. And also I wanted the YSL matching card holder in all black with the black hardware. And they didn't have it. And I went to four different places and they didn't have it. Now I could have ordered it online, but I just feel like when I'm spending that amount of money, I kind of want to get the experience and I want to walk out with my stuff like I want it in my hands after I spend that much money just me personally so I couldn't find it in store so I was like you know what maybe it's a sign that I don't need that bag right now maybe I shouldn't get it so I ended up making a purchase from um coach which I'm really surprised about because I feel like it's super affordable um it's still genuine leather it's still high quality um like a name brand or whatever and I've never bought anything from them so I have two orders coming in from them I ordered two bags and two wallets and it was really really cheap um not really really cheap but it was it was decent price for having two leather bags and two leather wallets to match so I'm going to show you guys what those look like today I know one of the bags are supposed to get here today so hopefully I can show you guys that in this vlog yeah my camera cut off but anyway um I just feel like it was too much money just to spend online and not have the experience so i ended up opting out and buying some other bags which i'll show you guys hopefully in this vlog when it's supposed to get here today and i will unbox it for you guys and show you um what else is going on like i said i want to do a juice cleanse i need to do my hair i need to film a video like i haven't filmed anything this week i haven't uploaded anything this week i just been a little all over the place and kind of like needing to get my life together so Okay, so update. I'm at Starbucks. I went to Marshall's, but they didn't have anything that I wanted. Like, they really didn't have a lot of stuff, so I'm not really sure what we're going to do now. I might head over to Ikea. You know, it's not a vlog unless I go to Ikea because I want to get um, two picture frames to go over my bed. And then I want to get two, like, little things to get to put inside. Um, but we'll see. I'm at Starbucks. I'm about to get me some coffee. I just woke up probably like 30 to 45 minutes ago and I'm awake. We are going to have a great day. We're going to do some fun stuff today. I'm feeling really inspired. I'm feeling really positive. I feel really happy. I feel just overall great about today. Why? I don't know, but I feel that way and we're going to carry this energy all the way through. So today is Thursday, January 21st. Whoa. Today is January 21st and it's 9.26 in the morning. So today we are going to be doing fun things and by fun things I mean productive things. So today we are going to be doing our hair. We're going to do our hair. We're going to film a video which is hair related. So by the time you guys see this vlog that video will already have been up. We're going to do hair related stuff. We're going to do deep conditioning 
situation, trying new products, I'm gonna be filming all of that. And I'm also going to be doing a juice cleanse. So I've talked about doing a juice cleanse maybe before in a couple of my other vlogs, but I'm really excited because today is the day. Um, I showed you guys yesterday me going to um, Pressed Juicery and picking up the juices for, this bag is really heavy, picking up the juices for the cleanse and they are here. I'm not going to start my cleanse until I get back because I'm going to go to the beauty supply really quick to pick up a couple things to do the hair cell that I want to do. Um, so I don't really know how my body's going to react, how I'm going to feel, so I don't really want to be out in public. Um, so what I'm going to do is show you guys the juices now and then run to the beauty supply because they don't open until 10 so i'm going to run to the beauty supply so loud i'm going to run to the beauty supply and then get everything i need come back start setting up to film my video or maybe i should set it before i leave i don't know i'll figure that out but i went to press juicery and right now they have a promotion where you get six juices for 29 dollars so that's what i did i was going to do the half day juice cleanse and that's when you get four juices and one shot but i was like honestly i don't eat that much throughout the day anyway so i'm like i should be able to be full throughout the day because you can also drink lots and lots of water and he said needless to say like if you do get hungry you can eat like some peanuts almonds cashews something in the nut family to have that has a lot of protein to really help you like stay full throughout the day so here is the bag this is the bag this is the camera the mini camera bag from coach and this is in pebble leather and it's so freaking soft and it also has silver hardware on it and it has a long strap so i can wear it on the shoulder or i can wear it as a crossbody which i really love because it gives a little bit more versatility and it fits so much it's called a mini but it fits a lot of stuff like it's mini, but it fits everything. It fits my iPhone 11 Pro Max, my keys, my other card holder, my glasses, my wallet, three lip glosses, which is unnecessary at this time, but still in there, and hand sanitizer, and something else, I think. No, I think that's all that I have in there. But I really, really love this bag, and then on the back, it comes with a little pocket so you can slide things in there. And then also in the inside... And also on the inside of the purse, it has a little pocket and then it has a little two card holders as well. So you can just slide like your cash or your coins in there, which I really, really love. And this is what the inside of the bag looks like. And like I said, it holds a lot of stuff. So I really actually love this bag. I've used it yesterday for the first time because it actually came yesterday while I was on my way out the house. And I really am surprised how much I love the bag and how much I really appreciate it because I could have just got like something else or kept using like my little bags that I got from like pretty little thing and stuff but I was like for an everyday bag I want to have something that's real leather that's sustainable that will last me for a really long time and I was like this is super super cute and I love the style and the shape of it and I wore it yesterday and I actually got tons of compliments on it so that is always a good sign when you're getting compliments on your bag it's good it makes you feel good it's like okay I spent my money on something good it's like okay I spent my money on something good good job Jade and I also ordered a wallet to go with it but the wallet didn't come the same time as the purse came so the purse came before the wallet and then I ordered another purse and another wallet which gets here on the 26th I think of January so we shall see I think the last three items that I order are going to all come together so I'll also show you guys those the other purse she's more dressy she's more sassy she's more you know stylish and like mm, more she has more of a luxury feel but I'll show you guys this is more like of my everyday bag that I'm gonna be using to go to the market go to, to run errands and stuff like that so yeah all right guys so don't mind the fact that wait first of all, I'm trying to set you up hold on okay so the angle is terrible um don't mind it but I just finished filming the um video that i need to film i didn't finish filming all of it but i did film the first part of it so now i'm letting the treatment sit on my hair and all that good stuff i have like 45 minutes to let it just sit there but i'm about to move on to my second juice i also want to get a new camera so bad um this one just doesn't focus as fast and like the lighting it takes it a minute to adjust i don't know Anyway, I want to get a new camera. We'll talk about that a little bit later. So I got a little hungry and now I'm on to my second juice. The first juice was actually pretty good. I was kind of shocked because there is no sugar or no um, additives or no preservatives. Like there's literally nothing but the fruit and the 
drink like what it says in there is what's in there and it was pretty good and i don't really like celery but i was really shocked anyway so i'm hungry again so now i'm going to move on to the second juice this is the citrus one yeah citrus one it has cucumber pineapple coconut water lemon and aloe vera and aloe vera just seems to be the vibe for today because that's what i have in my hair right now and i'm drinking it and i have on green it's just i'm just all around a healthy bitch it's healthy <laughs> anyway i'm going to try this out and see how it tastes so far the cleanse is going pretty good i've only had one other juice this will be my second one but like i said the flavor wasn't bad at all and i'm, I'm kind of shocked so let's taste it's not terrible honestly the first one was a little bit more sweet um this one is less sweet but it's not bad and it, it says citrus but the only citrus it has in there is the lemon i guess definitely more cucumbery um you can taste the lemon and a little bit of the pineapple after you like swallow it you can taste like a little bit of the pineapple it's not terrible this one has 130 calories the first juice had 140 so it kept me full for a little while longer um this one has 130 so i'm gonna just sit here and drink this mm. because i'm hungry and i can't eat so let's see how this goes and what i like to do is i like to chug these because if you chug it you don't think about how it tastes you just hurry up you drink it you get full you move on to the next one or the rest of your day and that's that so i'm gonna finish this and then i'm gonna finish filming and i'll probably check in with you guys when i get ready to actually do my hair because i want to do um some bantu knots and i want to switch it up so i'll check in with you guys once i'm done with this
today is January 22nd. It's 11.15. I did my, well, I didn't do my hair. I did my hair last night. But look at my new hair. Is she cute? I think it's cute. I think it's spunky. And I think it's a cute protective style, especially since my wig is on the way. I think it's cute. I just finished taking some photos. I did my makeup. I woke up at like 8 this morning. I started filming a video, but my neighbors started getting really, really loud. They were playing music and bumping, jumping, you know, having a parade upstairs. So I had to stop filming and take a break so that I could, you know, make it through the day and not get upset. Anyway, I um, am actually making me some breakfast. Well, I'm just making a bagel. And then I'm going to sit back down and finish filming my video. I'm actually filming a fragrance haul video, which I'm excited about because I've never done a video like this. And I'm really excited to share with you guys all of the fragrances that I have or some of my favorite fragrances. And um, I lost my train of thought. I was thinking about something else. Anyway, hope you guys are enjoying the vlog so far. What do you think of my, my new hair? Like, I think it's cute. Comment down below new thoughts. Comment down below thoughts on the new do, new hair, who this. Mm. Really quick before I head out, I just want to show you the fragrance that I'm wearing today. And it's the Flora Rose from Dossier. And when I tell you, it smells so freaking good. I've already did a video of my favorite fragrances on my channel. I will link it in this video. But this smells amazing. Hey guys. So I just made it back. And I put on some lip balm because... Be loud then, just be rude. Put on some lip balm, my lips are extra dry. It's been raining the last couple days here in LA, so that means the weather is cold, which I'm not mad about. Anyway, so I went to the nail supply store. It's called the Nail Lab, I think it's called. I took a picture of the, the building. Let me see. Yeah, it's called the Nail Lab. And they're located in LA. They have really, really cool stuff if you're into doing nails and stuff like that. So let me show you what I got. I got this IBD hard gel. It looks like looks like this. I love this stuff because it keeps my nails like really, really hard. I actually broke this one and it looks nasty. My nails look gross. So I want to take um, the gel off and then redo it. But this hand looks pretty decent. I haven't broken any nails. Just need to shape them and just get them looking right. So I'm going to use this. I'm not going to do it today. Probably do it tomorrow because I have to finish editing a video for tomorrow um and then i picked up four new gel uh polishes so this is by a company called what are they called i think it's called gel beauty i've never heard of this brand i've never used anything from this brand but i just wanted to try it out and see i actually drove to four different beauty supplies from the one that i showed you earlier because one the lady was rude i'm not giving my money to rude people two um they didn't have D&D &D and it was a Pacific color I wanted and they didn't have any brown shades that I wanted. So I drove around and then I ended up finding the nail lab. But anyway, this is called Gel Beauty. Like this is the brand and it's this peachy, like orangey pumpkin spice kind of color, which is perfect for fall. And this shade is called Country Chic. No, Country Chick, I think. The thing is blocking it. No, it's called Country Chic. And that's what that one looks like, which is a pretty little spicy pumpkin color. And then I picked up another color from the same brand. And this is called Old Terracotta. And it's this really pretty brown shade. It's like a milk chocolate brown, which I've been wanting a shade like this for a really, really long time to add to my collection because I don't have any browns. And it's just so freaking pretty. Got that. And then I picked up another one from, oh no, this is a different brand. This is called Gel, Gel Elixir. And this is in the shade... I don't think it has a name. That sucks. I think my stuff has cute little names. Um, this is in the shade 161. Little focus. So the shade 161, it's like this mint green color. And it does come with a regular polish and a gel polish like the rest of them. And then I have one more from Gel Elixir. And it's also this green shade. Like this army fatigue, like army green color. And this is in the shade 180. So I got these to add to my collection because um, I need options. I'm trying to really stick to natural nails, especially with us being in quarantine and nail shops being um, like closed and not being able to get my acrylics. Like, I, oh, this is disgusting. Why is this like this? Ew. Why? Why would why would they make ugh, this is terrible? Why is this like this? Ew. Ugh. Packaging on this is horrible. 
Um, so update, my wallet came in from Coach, the one I was telling you guys about, and I'm definitely gonna send it back. I think I haven't opened it yet, but I was just looking online when I looked at my my um, like my orders and stuff. I was just like, this is not my style. But K okay, package like this, and sorry if you can hear the dogs in the background barking. They're going crazy. I'm gonna fill day with something. Um, this is what the wallet looks like. I just feel like it's too guyish. Like, when I saw it, I just thought, I don't know what I was thinking. I wasn't thinking. It was just very impulsive of me. But it's like a zip around wallet. And then it just has, like, these little compartments. And then some card holders. Somewhere you can put cash. A little slot for coins. And just, like, other receipts or whatever you want to put in there. But this is just not me. Like, I'm not happy about this. I don't know what possessed me to think that I wanted this. I don't know what the hell was going on when I put this in my cart, but this is very guyish to me. It's not, I'm very girly and feminine and this ain't it, Chief. So I'm definitely going to send this back. I'll probably do that tomorrow. I think it came with a return label. Yeah, it came with a return label. So I'm going to send this back because I just don't like it at all. And then it took a really, really long time to get here. I actually ordered this the same time I ordered my purse that I showed you guys my mini uh, camera bag and the purse has been here I've been wearing the bag and then this just got here today and I ordered this on the 18th so it took it a week to get here today's the no no it took it a little less than a week today's the 25th I think um yeah today's the 25th and I ordered it on the 18th or 17th and I waited for it and it's nothing like waiting for something to come and then it comes and then you don't like it or you don't care for it so I'm going to just send it back because I'm not really a huge fan of this. So that's what I'm about to do. Um, I'm about to put this stuff away and then I'm going to finish editing tomorrow's video because it has to go up tomorrow. And then I also got a wig, which by the time you guys see this video, that this video for this hair should already be out. This is a wig from Curly Me. And it's a headband wig and I'm really, really excited about it. Um, it also came with some headbands and some lashes that I'm not going to wear. Some lashes that I'm not going to wear. But um, I'll show you guys more of that in a more detailed video. But that's just everything that I picked up today or that came in today. So I'm going to start. Ed so now I'm about to start editing because it's, that video not going to edit itself. <laughs> hey guys, good morning. So I literally just woke up probably like. 20 25 minutes ago um i'm gonna show you guys what i got yesterday i went to the outlet and i brought you guys along with me but i really didn't vlog anything because it wasn't what i expected when it came to an outlet um i think i'm gonna try another place and i ended up driving an hour to ontario and then an hour back from ontario um but it was a nice experience it was a nice drive the drive wasn't too bad it kind of went by really fast but when i got there when i um went inside the store they really didn't have anything that i wanted to exchanged the item for so i ended up not getting anything and i got my mom a wallet um and just got the rest of my money back because it turns out the wallet that i bought was a man's wallet and i'm not a man babe so couldn't use it it was just so big and so masculine just very very aggressive and i was just like it's not me i'm very like dainty tiny small and cute type chick so that went back um when i got home luckily um, I got home just in time because I got a package and the package is the other bag that I told you that guys that I had ordered um, The only thing that I will say is ordering from the coach store They just don't package it like they should to me like they don't package it like a luxury experience But I mean that's just because I'm a sucker for packaging if you don't care about packaging then I would highly recommend going to the coach store just because or coach store or coach online because they have really really nice things um but anyway let me show you the bag so this is her isn't she pretty like just beautiful and when i tell you this bag the leather on this bag is so soft and just makes you want to squeeze it it, it feels like a blanket it's so soft it's just amazing so this is the coach claire bag and it does have gold detailing i picked this one because it was a little bit more fancy and i'm going to show you what i mean by like fancy i showed you guys my um coach camera bag that i got uh last week and this is what she looks like 
but this is more of like an everyday type bag just black sleek fits your normal everyday stuff inside but I felt like this bag was a little bit more dressy and like I can dress this up or I can dress this down and I felt like I needed two bags to like switch off and kind of branch out into something a little bit more classy a little bit more whatever that is but this is her and like I said it has gold detailing and one thing I love is this gold little coat symbol on the front I think it's Super tiny and dainty and cute. It's not too much. It's not overpowering, but it still looks pretty. And then when you open the bag inside, so when you open it inside, there's so much storage. There is one, two, three, four, five. And then on the back, there's also a pocket right here. So that is six storage compartments, which I love because I love having roomy bags and just making sure all my stuff can fit. And then the inside of the um, bag is this really pretty soft leather maroon color which I don't mind the inside of the bag having a little bit of color because you literally can't see it until you open the bag and I think it's color but since it's a darker color it's not too overpowering and it still looks really pretty and the bag just feels so freaking nice and then I love that this has a zipper compartment on the front so I can put my phone here I can put cards here I could put my wallet here and it's extra secure because it does have a zipper um, I love that and then I love that you can wear this bag so many different ways um, then I went ahead and picked up a matching wallet um, I already put my stuff in it I couldn't wait I was waiting for this wallet to get here this is actually the exact wallet that I got my mom we wanted to get matching wallets and she really really loved this one and she likes card holders and she actually needed one so I got her that this is so stinking pretty and it's just so soft and it just again it feels very very luxurious and just very high quality and I love that so I have so much space it looks tiny but there's stuff all in the center then there's two card holders on each side it just holds the perfect amount of card holders 